Hello YouTube. In this video, I will explain how to add referencing and citation um, inside Word uh, by using the tools um, provided by uh, Word 2011 for Mac without the need for an extra program like EndNote. Um, it's really simple. First, you need to show the toolbox uh, for the referencing and for that you can do it from first view and toolbox here you can add reference tools and then the window for referencing tool will appear uh, you just have to click on the book icon here which is citation and then you can see a list of references we're gonna talk about this one later on the second one uh, you can do from toolbox here the icon in the ribbon you just click on it and it the window will show uh, the other way is from the secondary ribbon on on the um, on the word 2011 for Mac you just kind of look on documents and elements and here you can see citation reference and then there is manage you just click on manage and this window will appear now here's the three reference um, in word so I just want to remove them now now, if you are starting with this reference, let's say you want to start from zero, just like here. Um, you want to add a reference from the citation list. It's going to be empty. You just have a plus sign. Click on the plus sign, and then the create a new source window will open. From here, you can choose what kind, choose what kind of reference you're going to be adding, a book or a book section. And as you can see, the fields will change uh, when you change your uh, resource. Uh, let's see um, an article in a journal. Let's see author one, title one, and journal one, um, year 2015, and pages one to 23, for example, and then we click OK. As you can see, it's entered. Of course, you're going to have to enter this whenever you read. Let's say we're talking about um, video for you YouTube channel. And then I will add the reference here. I'll just double click on the reference that I just made and it will be entered. Now, the thing is, if you want to add another reference, uh, another, you just kind of clip, uh, clip, uh, continue by clicking the plus sign. Now, if you want to have uh, to go back to previously entered um, um, references, you go click on the gear sign here, and then you go to Citation Source Manager, and then here will appear uh, the uh, all the references. For example, I added this reference earlier. I will just copy it, and um, I want to use this one. I will just copy it, and I also can edit and add new uh, referencing. Uh, here again I can add from here new referencing if you want to add the references first um, and of course if you want to edit here is in order to edit um, different um, reference as well if you want to change authors or something like that and then you click close and you can see here the list change so again you continue a second sorry second video and I would like to add this reference and then I will say the video and I would like to add this reference and voila let's see when you finish from adding references the way you want them to and um, let's see if you want to change the style from here citation style here are the list of the citation style let's see you want the numerical and then click on numerical and here you go you have one one two three um, and then there are the Chicago one which is the one that was already existing um, by the, the author's name and the year and let's see other styles like nature where is nature here is nature yeah here is the nature uh, reference system now when you I will go with numerical now when you finish from doing that, of course you want to add the biography and that should be really easy. Um, you go to the second ribbon which is documentation, documents elements. Let's see, usually you're going to start at home and um, should be here documents and ele document elements. And here 
you can have a biography and you can insert any one of these um, let's see let's see biography here are one two and three one is title one author one journal one and then the second one which is backer and then the third one the example and this way uh, of course when you do some changes in, in here then you can always click and always can go update um, so edit the citation edit the source or even this is to edit or even to update Satoshi and um, citation and biography in case if you want the change to happen in, in both of them in order to update the whole documents I mean in this video uh, just a very quick example that you can add um, uh, referencing on Word 2011 without the need for an extra program like EndNote to be installed on your software and it gives you the same results and it's the same process. Thanks for watching.